transferring the Ubuntu Droid Beta 1 to a SD card root directory a folder called SDX and a folder called zip take the UD transform beta 1 and drag it to your SD card this is what would Josh do and today we are going to be putting EXT4 and Ubuntu Droid on the Samsung transform so we're going to start by holding down volume down the voice button the power button go to file browser SD card and then SDX and then you need to have this file called recovery underscore ext dot rfs menu menu home and it should say that it flashed successfully reboot to recovery go to console E X T and then hold down F N and R so you'll get four and then press enter. Now you have EXT four and you can confirm that by looking at that and it says EXT four. Apply zip from SD card. This one and then home. Now we're gonna reboot the system. Now we are prompted with the option of choosing either Launcher or Zeme. Of course, I'm going to go with my normal ADW. One, two, three, there you go. Y'all always uh, talk about live wallpapers. There you go. Settings. About phone. There you go. And uh, let's see if it has the reboot options. Ooh, it does. Cool. That was less than a minute. That was cool. Unlock. Oh, that's cool. Ah, I could live with that. That's pretty cool. Barcode scanner. Yep, that's something you gotta have. My files. Power control. That's... That's weird. What's power control? Flash mode. So, right here, widgets. Still normal. Anyways, this was created by Dodge JCR and many other devs. One Love did the theme, and I know there's more people, but I can't think of them all. Oh, Joseph Mother did the kernel, or at least helped with it, started it or something. So, I have absolutely nothing to do with this. I am not a dev, and I'm just installing it and showing people what it looks like and how to install it. That's cool. I hooked my phone up to my computer, and when I drag this down to enable the USB, it has that little Android guy, and it has these little things at the top where you can control the brightness and the Wi-Fi and GPS syncing vibrate data so that's pretty freaking sweet I do really like that thank you SDX for everything you've done so far you have made this phone a much better phone than it actually is thank you that's another thing that's pretty cool while it's charging it has a little spinning thing to let you know it's charging that's pretty freaking sweet People are reporting that they're having issues with Titania Backup, uh, Vampire Foe, and a couple other people. And let's see if I have issues with it. With Cred Kernel Kernel.
So far it's working. Awesome. Sweet. All my apps are back. Oh, I moved all my apps to my SD card, and when I restored it, it didn't do that. So I have a hundred and something apps moved to my SD card now. This is what would Josh do, and I'm out.